Hello, welcome back to Pansy, welcome back to the channel, and welcome back to the series where we are making a series of gardens. I'm really pleased with how these gardens turned out last week, and today we're going to be putting the finishing touches onto the gardens and having a look how it looks from first person view because, to be, in my opinion, this is the, the most important view. Just in my butterfly house now, you can see some butterflies up high. I really like how this turned out last week, and I'm very pleased with it. Some of these plants here are actually floating, but don't worry, we do sort that out later in the episode. Plants there are floating as well. I love how the sun shines through the trees there. I think it helps bring the whole build together and it just looks really nice. see some of the butterflies here. This is one of the invisible uh, walkthrough exhibits and you can see some of them on the butterfly house kind of things there. I really like how this has turned out with the walker exhibits and they're just being butterflies flying around. Sun shining through that tree there looks really nice. Some butterfly flying there, as you, um, hopefully, you just saw it. So, we're gonna extend the path this way um, just a bit, and then what we're gonna do is extend the gardens down by the pallet it used to be. Um, I did say this in the last episode, but um, I think it sounded a bit like palace, so. Just to clarify, I did mean palette. I'm just adding these red filler bushes here um, to fill in this area. We use a range of different plants for the finished piece. Just moving some of our butterfly bushes here to f help fill in the, this area. Just adding these pinky orange flowers as well. King proteas. I'm now just adding in these trees to act as a border between the rest of gardens and the outside. Just adding in these purple red bushes. Now I'm adding pink flowers. Just having a look from the first person view big bear just to make sure it looks nice from whoever the guests will see it from. Just 
just moving some of the plants so they fit nicer with the garden. extending the trees to go all the way around this section of the garden. Now we're going to add um, these bushes all the way around to border this section of the garden. And in fact we're going to border the whole garden. Just moving them to go smoother onto the rest of this path. And I'm now moving them here as well. I rotate them each time just to make it look a bit more random. But obviously it can't be helped um, because we only have a limited number of models in the game. And I thought it would just be quicker just to use the same one but rotate it. Because this took a while. I think it helps uh, define where the garden is though and so you're not just looking at a field to the left and loads of flowers to the right and it gives a nice border to where the edge of the garden is. I really don't think you can tell that they're the same model of bushes. This is what I was talking about, the plants floating, so this is um, where I'm just correcting it now. Just using the multi-select tool to do them all at once, so they'll all be the same height, although I do forget some plants, so then I go back and do them. bushes border the garden. And I like how this section of the garden turned out as well. It's really nice how these gardens turned out and I'm really proud of it. I think it looks amazing, even uh, better when you change it to sunset. So now I'm just going to adjust our plans for the series and correct some of the um, plans. So I'm shrinking the hill because I don't think the hill needs to be that big. in. So the cactus gardens is what we'll be making in either the next episode or the episode after, um, but definitely very soon. Uh, that is going to be the next big project. I'm just adding in more general gardens to the rest, so there's more space for where flowers and stuff can be. I'm removing valley from the river because it's not going to be a valley, it's just going to be a river and also we've already made it. Thanks for watching, like and subscribe and join me next week for the next episode. Bye.